Morning, 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 morning. Let's go. Morning motivation. I woke up today. I'm like, Marv, don't, don't forget the small things in life that mean so much. Meaning like, yo, I woke up today and I had shelter. That's still a big deal. Yo, I woke up today and not only did I have shelter, I, my body parts started responding this way they were supposed to respond. To. Like, I'm not, I'm not paralyzed. Somebody woke up paralyzed this morning. Someone woke up blind today. Someone will do anything anything if they could just see the sunrise this morning so all these things that i got to be grateful for i try to hold on to because that's one of the keys to keeping a positive mindset but anyway right so check it out right i'm in the scripture this what the scripture says this morning man this thing is crazy this is proverbs 18 20 and 21 a man's stomach shall be satisfied from the fruit of his mouth from the produce of his lips he shall be filled Death and life are in the power of the tongue, and those who love it will eat its fruit. So as I started like thinking about that and meditating on that, a man's stomach will be satisfied by the fruit of his mouth. Well, maybe if your stomach's turning and if you ain't feeling well, maybe it's because of the things you're saying. Like we, it says life and death is in the power of the tongue. Like you really can say something to someone that can really encourage them, and you can say something to someone that can really destroy them. And let's talk about ourselves for a minute. Let's talk about life and death and the power of the tongue. To me, like what I say about myself, what I think about myself. Like I need, I, I just got in the habit of just, nah, I can't do that. Nah, I ain't smart enough. Nah, I ain't no lawyer. Nah, I ain't no doctor. Yeah, no, I'm not none of them things, but I don't have to always, I done got in the habit of putting myself down with my words and I'm not doing that no more. No, I don't know how to do that, but I know I can learn. No, no, I, I don't. But, you know, I could I could try and figure it out because I'm capable just like anyone else is capable. So we need to watch our words because they really are powerful. And when you start to speak uh, good and valuable things, you'll start to satisfy your stomach. You'll start to be at ease with yourself because of the words that are coming out. Man, we live in a dark world. There's so much negativity. When I, Whenever I come up to someone, hey, what's going on? You know, you know man, life's a be. uh uh, I don't know, just trying to hang It's like, come on, man. Life's a gift, man. Life's a gift. And, and half of us ain't even going through some of the problems that real people in other countries or real struggles that people are really going through. So when I come across someone and they tell me, uh, I'm like, damn, what's wrong? Why you got the Sour Patch face? Oh, uh, they put too much creamer in my coffee today. Put too much. Your biggest problem is they put too much creamer in your coffee. Come on, man. Get out of that, man. We need to, we need to really cherish the lives that we got. And first and foremost, we really need to get our lives right with God because once we get right with God, he's going to be able to give you the life that you, you want. And that doesn't mean that it's always going to be peachy and clean when you walk with the Lord. Trust me. It says the path is narrow. Few will find it, but it's worth it. It's encouraging. Sometimes I don't even know how I make it. It's not my strength, though. It's his strength. So, man, I'm just here to encourage you this morning. Watch the world words that come out of your mouth today. I want you to challenge yourself today and not only watch the words to what you say about others or situations. I want you to challenge. I want to challenge you to say so many good things about you today. I want you to just reflect on you. I want you to say how strong you are. I want you to say how independent you are. I want you to say how free you are. I want you to say how, how rich you are. I want you to say how patient you are. I want you to get in the habit of saying good things about you. Hey Amen. Love y'all. God bless. Have a great day.